California support that had come their way. And they talked about how each family is going through this differently in their own unique way and that the public needs to understand that. They also announced that they have started a website for those families, mysandyhookfamily.org. That's the website. They say it's a way for them to help one another, to communicate, to be together and get through this in their own way. At the end of the statement that was prepared, each family member mm. came by and said that they will be lighting a candle for the loved one that they lost. And that really that really hit me. We weren't expecting that. And, and they described either their children or, or their sister or whoever they had lost in their own way, say gorgeous or irrepressible or wonderful. And you could just feel it coming through the screen watching this. I also want to tell you that this follows a press conference that was held just two hours ago in Newtown, also <laughs> by city officials. And the main message of this press conference was we are doing this now to answer your questions because we really are pleading with the media to stay away from Newtown on Saturday, on that one year mark, saying we need our own time to heal without the presence of all the media. Here is what Pat Lodra said. She is like the mayor of the town, the first selectman. Listen. We're trying to respect the world's interest in us, and we've certainly benefited from that interest in many ways. Uh, but we also have a real need for our community to, to gain its foothold uh, a little bit, particularly around this very difficult time. So mm -hmm. it, it, we, pay a, we pay a price when 